عبده ورسوله صلوات ربي وسلامه عليه وعلى اله وصحبه ومن تبعهم باحسان الى يوم الدين. اما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته. ان شاء الله وندماشن ك مدينه نو ديزا يعني متاو ازي وندموش قالوا في السبع لزياراني متاو ميادرغو بالانجليزيا نو ميادرغونا امريكاينا انجليزيا نو ميادرغو اني تركو ملاتو الله عند عند مكر لا متاو لزيارا نو متاو انا انا مكر نجر يو اتلال سلام ما عرفنا بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين ما بعد فاعلم رحمكم الله أنه يجب علينا أن تعلم أربع مسائل الأولى العلم so as my brother explained to you I'm from America, and so this talk, I will speak to you in English, and my brother Nasruddin will translate for you. So I said that know that it's an obligation upon us all as Muslims to know four things, that there's four very important things for us all to know. And the first thing for us to know is that is knowing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and knowing the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and knowing the religion of Islam of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's deen with the textual proofs, with the evidences from the kitab illah wa sunnah to Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. <laughs> اعلم رحمك الله الله يزنلنا الله يزنلناونا اوقونا يا ميتا اوقو نغير مزنو ياند انداچن ياند انداچ لي گديتا يونوتن اراث متراتاي نتبوچ ال نزام مندنو ياند اند سو لي گديتا يونو اراث نغروچ يمجمرياو ما اوقنا اوقت يا موقت سلا مندنو مناوقو بزو اينت يوقت اينت ال ارلا سلا مندنو مناوقو بلا يتطيقن مجمريا معرفة الله الله سبحانه وتعالى ما وك فمكتل رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم ما وك فذاب مكتل دمو دين الإسلام يهم الدين بمرجع بتتكف ملكه مرجع بالله ملكه ما وكنا النزي يمجمريا وتو يمجمريا وش ميكاتو تسيون ولا تنيا ودمو يكتلنا إن شاء الله. so knowledge of Allah سبحانه وتعالى this encompasses Knowing Allah Tabaraka wa Ta'ala bi asma'i wa sifatihi and by his rububiyyatihi wa uluhiyyatihi. So knowledge, true knowledge is knowing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. True knowledge is not what we get necessarily in the universities. In the ulama they talk about ilm al you know, the beneficial knowledge. The beneficial knowledge is not from philosophy. It is not from necessarily, although we can benefit from science and other knowledge, the true knowledge of, is of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and knowing rububiyyah, uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wa uluhiyyatihi wa al asma wa sifatihi. ولكن هناك اشخاص يمكنهم ان يكونوا من الممكن 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 ان يكونوا فطرت بما يسكن بالجزي ايهن ايهن العالم بما يسكن بالجزي ليلا منم اغار كغونو اغاج اندريلو بروبوب ياو الله سبحانه وتعالى بتشينيا خالق فطاري وين دمو بتشينيا سي ساي لغات اندزي هون دمو اسو بتشا دمو ايهن العالم استنابار مهونو روبوب يا ميبالو يا توحيد الروبوب يا مالك الله سبحانه وتعالى بغيتنتو بتشينيا مهونو يا من اوقات ولتنياو دمو الله سبحانه وتعالى سنا ملك ببتشينيت 
ተውሂድን ኡሉሂያ ሚባለው አላህ ሱብሃነ ወተዓላ ባአምልኮ መነጠል ብቸኛ ማድረግ ሌላን አካል ሳይቀላቀል ማለት ነው። በዚህ መልኩ አላህ ሱብሃነ ወተዓላ ማወቅ እንደዚሁም ደግሞ ለአላህ ሱብሃነ ወተዓላ መልካምና በጣም እጅግ ያማሩ ስሞችና ባህሪ ያታሉ። በዛ መልኩ አላህ ሱብሃነ ወተዓላ ለናቀው ይገባል ይሄ ነው ጠቃሚ ዕውቀት የሚባል። نعم ف as my brother explained tawhid it has three categories and this is this comes from the nusus or the evidences of the quran and the sunnah that the rububiyah of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the uluhiyah of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his al asma wa sifat and the position of ahl sunnah is that we affirm allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's names and attributes kama jaa fi kitabillah wa sunnati rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam so we affirm allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's al asma wa sifat kama thabata uh in the nusus the way that it comes in the quran and the sunnah ወንድማችን እኛ ያስተላልፈው ያለው መልእክ ምንድነው እነዚህ ከላይ የጠቀስናቸውን አላህ ሱብሃነ ወተዓላ መናቀበት ይሆነ አላህ ብቻኛ ተመላኪነቱን እንደዚሁ ብቻኛ ጌትነቱን እንደዚሁ ደግሞ ለሱ ያማሩ ባህሪያትና መልካም የሆኑ ስሞች እንዳሉት በእነዛም ብቻኛ ማንም ሊጋራው እንደማይገባ ስናቅ እነዚህ የምናውቀበት ምንጭ አህለ ሱና ወጀማአ ጋ ምንድነው ከኪታብና ከሱና ከቁርአንና ከሐዲስ ያገኘነውን መሰረት አድርገን ነው እንጂ ليلا كراثاتي فطر انا دلم ان الذين يدرو جننا درغو معناتنا ان هذه اوقاتك كلا يتقسناچون الله ني منا قبت منچو مندنو قراننا سنه كرسا سلم تككلن يتزجبل السناوت ان الذاناچو منچوچ نيول كذا وقي يراثاتين فلسفنا ليلا نغير هايچمربت ما منچوچو كتابنا سنانا چو يهم لان هذه اوقاتك ان النالج اوف توحيد از فروم ذا اشرف العلم it's from the most important the most high the highest knowledge that anyone uh could attain is knowledge of the creator and knowledge of their position in relation to their creator knowledge of your station in this world and your purpose in life kama qala ta'ala wa ma khalaqtu al jinna wal ins illa liya'budun so allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes makes it clear for us that our purpose is that is to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and this is in fact tawhid al uluhiyah this is tawhid al ibadah this is tawhid uh the tawhid of worship is in worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and worshiping him alone that's why we must have knowledge the ilm comes before uh before worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala you can't worship Allah tabarak wa ta'ala without ilm ይሄ ተውሂድ ከውቀቶች ሁሉ ዋናው ቁንጮና ወልሳኙ ትምርት ከውቀቶች ሁሉ የሚቀደሙ ተውሂድ የተውሂድ ዕቀት ምክንያቱም ከአላህ ሰዎችና ከጌታቸው ከአላህ ጋር ያላችሁ ግንኙነት የሚገለጸው በተውሂድ ስለሆነ ያንን መጀመሪያ ማወቅ አለባችሁ ስለ ተውሂድ በደንብ ማወቅ አለባችሁ ከውቀቶች ሁሉ ዋናው ቁንጮ ተውሂድ ነው እንደዚሁም ደግሞ የተውሂድ ምናውቀበት ምክንያት ምንድነው እዚ ዓለም ላይ የምንኖርበትን አላማ የሚያሳውቀን የውቀት አይነት ስለሆነ ተውሂድን ሁሉ ጥሪ የሚደረግበት ከውቀቶች ሁሉ የበላ ያደረገበት እዚ ዓለም ላይ የተገኘንበት አላማ ምናውቀበት ዛም አላህ ስብሐ ወተዓላ ቁርአን ምን ይላል ወማ ኸለቅቱ ልጅና ወልኢንሳ ኢላ ሊያዕቡዱ አጋንንትም ሆነ ሰዎችን አልፈጠርኩ ይላል አላህ ስብሐ ወተዓላ ለምን ቢሆን እንጂ የተፈጠሩለት አላማ ምን ቢሆን እንጂ አላህ ስብሐ ወተዓላ በብቸኝነት ሊገዙና ሊያመልኩ ቢሆን እንጂ አልተፈጠሩ ሚኖሩበት አላማ ምንድነው አላህን ሊገዙ ነው ስለዚህ አላህን ሊገዙበት አላህን የሚያመልኩት እንዴት እንደሆነ መጀመሪያ ማወቅ አለባችሁ ተግባር ውስጥ ከመግባታችሁ በፊት ስለዚህ ዕውቀት ላይ ትኩረት ይሰጥ የሚባለው ነው ምንድነው አላህን ለማምለክ ሆነ አላማው እዚ ለዚ ምድር ላይ የሚኖርበት አላማ አላህን ለማምለክ ሆነ ያ አላማ ደሞ የሚታወቀው መጀመሪያ ዕውቀት ያስፈልጋል ነው and the importance of this knowledge cannot be overemphasized because as we know even the christians the protestants the catholics uh and all of the other different sects of christianity they all believe in a form of tawhid they all believe in rububiyah 
They believe Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is al-khaliq, al-raziq. Yeah, and that he is, uh, you know, a Rabb al-alameen. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sustains us. The Christians believe this. But what makes the Muslims distinct from the Christians is the Muslims affirm all the attributes of, of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the Muslims uh, have knowledge of and worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alone. They don't attribute partners. So all the forms of Tawheed are included in Islam. This is... The true knowledge. This is knowledge that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made fard upon us. Fard al ayn ala al muslimin. Talab al ilm fariditu ala kulli muslim. Kama qala nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So we know from the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam's statement that we must gain the knowledge of those things that are, uh, that are wajib upon us. ነገር <laughs> ነገር ግን እስልምና ውስጥ ስንገባ ይህ የተውሂድ ነገር አንደኛ በውቀት ላይ ተመሰረተ ነው ሁለተኛ ደግሞ ሁለተኛ ሌላ ይቀላቀለ ወይም ያጓደለው ነገር ይለም ተውሂድን በሙሉ መልኩ ይዞ መጥቷል ቀድም እንዳልነ ቀድም እንደከፋፈል ነው አላህ Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala በጌትነቱ ብቻኛ እናደርጋለን እነሱ እቺን ብቻ ነው ገንጥለው የሚመስክሩት ተመተመላኪነቱም እንደዚሁ ብቻኛ ተመላኪ እንደሆነ ብቻኛ ስሞችና እንደዚሁም ባህሪያቶች ለሱ ብቻ ያማሩ መልካም ይሆኑ እንዳሉት እናረጋግጣለን እስልምና ውስጥ ሙሉ ሆኖ ይገኛል ይሄ ነገር ማለት እና እነሱ ጋር ግን በተጓደለ መልኩ ነው ይሄ ነገር የሚገኘው ስለዚህ ይሄን ዕውቀት ስለ ወስላት ነው ይሄ ዕውቀት በዕውቀት ይሄ የተውሂድ ክፍል በዕውቀት ላይ ተመርኮዘ መሆን አለበት ነው ምክንያቱም ስለዚህ መፈለግ ረሱ አሰለም ይላሉ ጣለቡ ኢልሚ ፈሪዘቱን አላ ኩሊ ሙስሊሚን ወሙስሊማ ዕውቀትን መፈለግ በተለይ የዚህን የተውሂድን ክፍል ዕውቀት መፈለግ በሙስሊም ሴት ላይ የሚሆን ወንድ ወንድ ላይ ግዴታ አድርጓል ግዴታ ነው ይላል ረሱ አሰለም نعم so I can't overemphasize and I don't want to take up all your time just speaking about tawhid although what we say is definitely not sufficient but I want to also emphasize the importance of knowing the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and this is the only way you can follow the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said alaykum bi sunnati wa sunnat al khulafa ar rashidin al mahdiyin adu alayha bi nawadij wa iyyakum wa muhtathat al amur fa inna kullu bid'atin dalala so we know that the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam commanded us to follow his sunnah and allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has commanded us in the quran to follow the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam ያው በዚያ አጥሳት ውስጥ ለተውሂድ ብቻ ሊዞ መሰከን አልፈለኩም እንጂ በትክክል ወይም በበቂ ሆነ መልኩ አልተናገርኩም ስለተውሂድ ነገር ግን ሌላ መጥቀስ ያለብኝ ነጥብ ምንድነው ይላል ርሳህ ሰለም እንሱና አጥንቆ መጥቀስ ስለአላህ ስብሐ ወተዓላ ካወቀን በኋላ ደግሞ ሁለተኛ የመጣው ምንድነው ርሳህ ሰለም እንሱና በደንብ ማወቅ አለብን ርሳህ ሰለም አለይኩም ቢሱነቲ ወሱነቲ ኹለፋኢ ራሺዲን አደረ ኢላ ርሳህ ሰለም በኔ ፈለግ ላይ በኔ ሱና ላይ አደረ እንደዚሁም ደግሞ እነዛ ቀንን መንገድ በተመሩት በሆኑት መሪዎች ኮለፋዎች መንገድ ላይ አደረ ያንን መንገድ በክራንች አጥርት በጥ በክራንች አጥርታችሁ በደም ባጥብቃችሁ ያዝ በደም በመንጋጋ አጥርታችሁ ወይም በደም ባጥብቃችሁ ያዝ ያንን መንገድ ምክንያቱም ከዛ በኋላ የሚከሰቱ ብዙ አዳዲስ የሚመጡና ዲን üst ያልነበሩ ሌሎች የሚለጣጠፉ ነገሮች አሉ እነዚህ ነገሮች ሁሉ አዲስ ፈጠራ አዲስ መጥ የተብሎ ይጣራል እነዚህ ነገሮች መጨረሻ ላይ ወደ እሳት ስለሚጥሉን እነዚህ ነገሮች ጥንቅቀን ሱናንም እንደዚሁ ማወቅ አለበት So the benefit of knowing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and knowing the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam is then you know the tariq ila jannah you know the way the path to get to jannah all of us want jannah so we have to know Allah tabarak wa ta'ala and his commandments 
and we have to know the sunnah of the Prophet وسلم, and how to follow the Prophet We have to know the sunnah first before we can follow. Now, <clears throat> so also thirdly, we must know the religion of of, of Al Islam with the textual proofs. We must know how to practice the shir, uh, Sharia to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala that was legislated by Allah Tabarak Wa Taala. And that was practiced and implemented by the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. We have to know the way to practice Islam. We have to have fiqh, fiqh ad-deen. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Man yurid Allahu bihi khayran yafiqahu fi deen So whenever Allah wants good for a person, He gives him ilm, He gives him fiqh and understanding, wisdom of how to practice Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala's deen. Allah <laughs> من يريد الله به خيرا يفقهه في الدين الله سبحانه وتعالى خير يشالت نسو الله سبحانه وتعالى يدين الإسلام من الزابي فهم يسات وعلي الله صلى الله عليه وسلم خير يتفلق للسو يدين الإسلام وقتنا يسات سلذي دين الإسلام بمن رجع بتدقف ملكو ما وقت سوستين يونت So if you're learning the Quran and you're memorizing something from the Sunnah of the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم and you're practicing then Allah is giving you some of that fiqh, some of that faham, inshallah ta'ala. Inshallah you're understanding what you are practicing and what you're reading from the Qur'an. This is some of it. And this shows, this is when Allah tabarak wa ta'ala loves someone. He gives them the fiqh of the deen. And the opposite is true. If someone, if they stay ignorant of the religion, this shows that they are further from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah shows you, He gives you the understanding, the fiqh ad is His way of showing you that He has love for you as His servant. <laughs> Allah <laughs> So firstly is the knowledge and secondly athania al amalu bi So the second thing is is once we have knowledge of the deen we practice that knowledge Okay, if you gain knowledge on how to pray uh, Nawafil Salat, then you begin to practice that. You begin, you begin to learn the hadith of the Prophet Sallallahu where he said, Yanzalu Rabbuna Tabarak wa Ta'ala Kulu Layla, Kulu Thulatha Layla Dunya. So then you begin to practice uh, Qiyamah Layl. So that way Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala will hear your prayer because you know that Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala comes down a Yanzil uh, during this time. This is the Amalu B. This is practicing that knowledge that you have gained. The knowledge of Kitab was Sunnah. Now, 
እና ምንድነው ሁለተኛው ነጥብ ከዒልሙ በኋላ ዒልሙ ላይ ሶስት ነገሮችን ተከተናል ከዛ በማስከተል ሌላው ያንዳንዳችንን እናጠ የሚገባ ነገር ይሄን ያወቀነው ንቀት ተግባር ላይ መዋል አመን ተግባር ወደ ስራ ላይ ማማምጣት ዕውቀት ብቻውን ምንም አይ ጥቅም የለው ያን ያወቀነው ነገር ተግባር ላይ ስለነው ነው ፍሬውም ይታየው ማለት ስለዚህ የተወሰነ የሰላት አሰጋገት ረሳ ሰለም እንዴት ሰላት እንደምንዳ እንደሚሰገድ ያወቀን እንደሆነ ተግባር ላይ ሰላት ነው ላልም ማለት ነው አንድ ሐዲስ ከረሳ ሰለም ስንዘማ ينزል ربنا الى سماء الدنيا هنا يبقى ثلث الليل ትግሌይቱ አንድ ሶስተኛ ሲቀር አላህ Subhanahu ወታላ ወደ سماء الدنيا ይወርዳል በዛ በወረደበት ሰዓት ደግሞ ይጠይቃል የማንን ወንጀል ነው ምምርለት ማንንም ይጠይቀኝ የምሰጠው ይያለ በሚልበት ሰዓት ይሄንን ሐዲስ ሲሰማ ሰውዬ ወደ ስራ ይመጣል ያመ ለይል ለማመዳል ለይል ቆሞ አላህ Subhanahu ወታላ መማጸን ለማመዳል ማለት ስለዚህ ዕውቀቱን ካወቀን በኋላ ወደ ተግባር መምጣት አለብን ይሄ ሁለተኛው ነጥብ ነው ያንላችን እናቀም ይገባ የመጀመሪያው ዕውቀት ነው ዕውቀት ብቻው ምንም አይጠቅም ፋይዳ የለው ከዛ ቀጥሎ ታይዞ ይመጣው ምንድነው ያ ዕውቀት ወደ ተግባር ሊመራ ይገባል and the third thing after of course while practicing is then to begin to give dawa but you give dawa with ilm and fiqh you give dawa when you have some knowledge of the religion at least give na- give share the knowledge to the extent that you're able to do and don't tajawuz al had don't go beyond the limits of the knowledge that you've attained so first and foremost you must have ilm and be practicing that knowledge and then you give dawa then you call people to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala you call people to in amr bi ma'ruf wa nahi anil munkar you call people to the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam በሶስተኛ ደረጃ የሚመጣው ዒልም ብለናል ዒልሙ ሲጠቃነሉተን ተናግረናል ከዛ በኋላ ተግባር ላይ ነው ተግባርን ካመጣን በኋላ ይሄን ስራ ወደ ራሳችን ያወቀነው ነገር ወደ ተግባር ካመጣን በኋላ ወደ ሶስተኛው ነጥ ምንድነው የሚሆነው አዳዋ ወደዚ ወደ አወቀነውና ወደ ተግበር ነው ወደ ተገበር ነው የሆነ ወደ ሆነው ስራ ወደ አወቀነው ወደ ሆነው ጥሩ መልካም የሆነ የሸሪዓ ዕውቀት ሰዎች እንጣራለ በውቀታችን ልክ ድንበር ማለፍ የለብንም ብሎ አስወሮበት በመናቀው ልክ የምናቀው ነገር ለሌሎች ማካፈል መቻል አለበት ራሳችን ብቻ ጋ ማስቀረጽ ሳይሆን ለሌሎችም መስጠት መቻል አለበት ዳዋ ወደዚ ወደ አወቀነው እንደዚህም ደግሞ ወደ ተገበር ነው ወደ ሆነው ስራ ጥሪ ማድረግ መቻል አለበት ይሄ ሶስተኛው ለናቀው የሚገባ ነጥብ ነው and the reason i emphasized going back to the knowledge the ilm is because there are many of us many muslims who because they don't have the proper knowledge then they want to give dawa and with this with their dawa they make many mistakes and with these mistakes they cause people to be more misguided than guidance because they see the truth as false and they see falsehood as truth maybe they're sincere they have ikhlas but they're not following the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam because they don't have the correct ilm they don't have the knowledge as allah tabarak wa ta'ala commands us in the quran fa'lam annahu la ilaha illallah wa astaghfir li dhanbik allah subhanahu wa ta'ala commands us to have knowledge he commands us to gain the knowledge first and then seek forgiveness so this shows us that we have to have the knowledge and then we practice and then we give the dawa indegana wede uqat tamalso ya takorabet net mindinno ይህ ዕውቀትን ማተኮር የተፈለገበት ምክንያት ምንድነው ሰዎች ከዚህ ዕውቀት ማነስ የተነሳ ዳዋ በሚያደርጉበት ሰዓት ትክክለኛው ንቁት ካለ ማወቃቸው የተነሳ የተለያየ ስተት ይፈጠራ ሰዎች ትክክለኛ የሆነውን ነገር እንደ ስተት ስተት የሆነውን ነገር ደግሞ እንደ ትክክል ማየት ይጀምራሉ ያ የመጣው ከምንድነው መጀመሪያ ትክክለኛ የሆነ የሸሪዓ ዕውቀት የላቸው የሚመዝኑ በነገር ስለል ይለ ተሳስተው እንደገና ሌሎችም ሰዎች ደግሞ ይባሰ ያሳስታሉ ማለት ስለዚህ መጀመሪያ ዕውቀት ነው የሚገባ አላህ Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala ምን ይላል ፈአለም አነሁ ላ ኢላሃ ኢላላህ ወስተግፊር ለዛንቢ አላህ Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala ዲጋ አቀማመጡ ቁርአን ላይ የቃላቶቹ አቀማመጦች ራሱ ላስተነተነው ሰው መልእክት አላችሁ ፈአለም አነሁ ላ ኢላሃ ኢላላህ አወቅ መጀመሪያ ከዛ ወስተግፊር ለዛንቢ ኢስቲፋር ስራ ማለት ተግባር ነው አይደለ ከዛ መጀመሪያ ካወቅ በኋላ ነው ወደ ተግባር መውጣት ያለብህ ወደ ዳዋ መጣራት የሚያለብህ ያወቀውን ነገር ነው ካወቅ በኋላ 
ስለዚህ ትክክለኛ ዕውቀት ኖር እንገባ ትክክለኛ ዕውቀት ከሌለን ሳይኖርን ግን ዳዋ መናደርግ ከሆነ ከኪታብ ከሱና የሆነ ዕውቀት ሳናገኝ ዳዋ መናደርግ ከሆነ ተሳስተን ሰዎች እንድሳፋቱ እናደርጋለን ስለዚህ ዒልም ላይ ትልቅ ትኩረት ነው የተገባ ዳዋ ማድረግ ከፈለገን ዳዋው በምን መሰረት ነው ያደረገ መሆን አለበት በውቀት መሆን አለበት and the fourth thing the last thing is sabr as sabr ala adafi this is patient being patient on the harm that comes to you while you're seeking the knowledge while you're gaining the ilm and this and having patience when you are uh trying to practice practicing the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and being patient when you're giving dawa and maybe people don't want to hear hear your dawa maybe the people refuse you maybe they flee from you but well i can have a minhaj al anbiya that's the sunnah and the way of the prophets that the people may reject you maybe they will harm you maybe they will do anything to you this all this requires patience And Allah Subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Allah ma sabirin Allah makes clear for us that Allah Subhanahu wa ta'ala is with those people who are patient those people who are patient on seeking the knowledge and patient in uh following his commands The arat mi adaraja mi metaw demo sabr ma adarga tigist ma adarga sabr min adargibacho botawochin eziw lay mayet inchilal sabr ba'il bamin lay ilmin bamifelegel ilmin bamifelegel lay sabr يتوسنا وقت توسد بيتشانو يتوادلنا ما علم بمفلج لي صبر ياسفلج تغست ياسفلج اندزيو دمو سرا لي مسنطا تغوارن بمنف يا يوقنو النجر تغوار لي بمنول بساعات الله سبحانه وتعالى يعززن بمنفصن بساعات تكلكلن سنرقن صبر ياسفلج اندزيو بسوسين درجه دعوان بمنادرك بغزي صبر ياسفلج مكنياتهم سوج لا يسمو يشلالو انت دعوه منم لا يدامطو يشلال ግን ይህ ነገር የአንቢያዎች ሁሉ መንገድ ነበር የነብያቶች ይህን ነገር ተጋፍጠውታል ማንም ሰው ይሰማቸው ሳይኖር ቀርቷል አንድ ሰው ሳይቀበላል ሳይሰማቸው ማለት ስለዚህ ጥሪ በሚናደርግበትን ሰዓት ሰዎች ሰውንም አልሰሙንም ሌሎችም አዛም በሚል ቢደርስብን ሰብር ሊናደርግ ይገባል ትግስ ሊናደርግ ይገባል all of those four masail that we mentioned all of those four points they come together in the verse of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wal asr inna al-insana la fi khusr illa alladhina amanu wa amilus salihati wa tawasaw bil haqqi wa tawasaw bis sabr all of those all of those points they come together in that verse Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes makes it clear for us by letting us know that all of mankind is in a loss all of us are in a loss then he makes istithna then he says illa alladhina amanu except for those who believe in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and that belief requires ilm lazam al ilm you must have knowledge if you believe in something illa alladhina amanu wa amilu salihat and though and to practice righteous deeds wa tawassaw bil haqqi wa tawassaw bis sabr and to call to the haq this is the dawa is calling to the haq calling to the truth and then calling and being patient upon that being patient upon that path all of those four points they come together in that verse of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala nabi kala yetakasna chu arat masarat ay netbot yanda andachi minnaqachi yigabu netboch Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ba and sura asr taqallu askamtachu يام سورة العصر لهنا والعصر الله سبحانه وتعالى بجزي عصم له نغرا ان الانسان لفي خسر يسولج بمولو بتقلالا بكسرت وسط كسروا في سارا وسط نو لو قال ابو هلا الله سبحانه وتعالى ليا بمن ليا الا الا عدد الاستثناء تبالى نطلع وطا كلهم ككسروا قال ابو هلا انما في قبال اربع بحريات يتلابسوا سوى سكا እነዛ እነማና ቼ መጀመረ ለለዚነ አመኑ እነዛ ያመኑ ሲቀሩ ኢማን ከምን ጋር ተያዘ ነው ከውቀት ጋር ተያዘ ኢማን ከዒልም ጋር ተያዘ ስለዚህ እነዛ ያመኑ የሚለው ውስጥ የመጀመረው ክፍል ዒልም ያለው አለ ማለት ነው ወአሚሉ ሷሊሃት መልካም ስራን ያስከትሉ አምኖ ብቻ በውቀት ላይ የተመረኮዘው ውቀት ብቻ ኖሯቸው አምኖ ብቻ ይቀሩ አይደለም መልካም ስራን ያስከትሉ وتواصوا بالحق الذين دموا ود حق نجر 
በሐቅ ነገር ላይ አደረይ ተባባሉ ወይ ይተጣሩ ዳዓው ያደረጉ ማለት ወተዋሰብ الصبر እንደዚሁም በصبر አደረይ ተባባሉ የተነካከሩ የተለያዩ ችግሮች ቀደም እንዳልነው ዓይልም ላይ አመል ላይ እንደዚሁ ዳዓው ላይ صبر ያስፈልጋል ማለት አላህ Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala ቀደም የተቀጠው ያለ ምን ብሏል ኢንላህ ማአሳቢር አላህ Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala ከታጋሽሽ ጋር ትግስተኛ ሳቢር ከሆኑ ሰዎች ጋር ስለዚህ صبر እዚ ስር ይተቃለማል እዚ ሱራ ላይ አራቱን ከላይ ተከፍተን አቅፋ ይዛልስ ማለት ኢማም ሻፊኢ ረህመሁ ﷲ said about that verse he said لو ما انزل الله حجتا على خلقه الا هذه سوره لا كفته he said if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had only revealed this verse this would be sufficient for uh, the creation and imam bukhari رحمه الله in his in sahih al bukhari in his most famous uh, work that we all benefit and cannot do without in protecting the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam he had a chapter entitled babun al ilm qabla al qawli wal amal bab al ilm qabla al qawli wal amal and in this chapter he started with the verse of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uh, uh kama qala ta'ala fa'lam innahu la ilaha illallah wa astaghfir li dhanbik so he showed us that we must have knowledge before we speak before we act and in order to practice islam we must have the ilm so i just wanted to share these words with you inshallah ta'ala and i hope that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala benefits us and benefits this gathering as we know the malaika are surrounding this gathering whenever you are gathered together to remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala or study his book or study the hadith of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam so we hope that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blesses this gathering and blesses us all to gain some benefit and benefit from one another jazakumullah khairan subhanaka allahumma wa bihamdika ashhadu an la ilaha illa anta astaghfiruka wa atubu ilaik سورة العصر وتملكة إمام الشافعي من بلوال لو ما أنزل الله إلا هذه السورة حجة على خلقه لكفته إمام الشافعي محمد بن عبدالله رضي الله عنه رحمه الله من يلالو الله سبحانه وتعالى كذي سورة ذي سورة سر يقفت شو بزو تنت نجر على ما إيهن سورة بتاعه تملكة بزو ما صار بيت أقوال جن إيهن سورة بتاعه يلالو إمام الشافعي በዳም አስተንተነው ማለት ይሄን ብቻ ሱራ አውርዶ ቢሆን ነው ሌላ ባመጣ ባያስከትል ለሰው ልጆች በቂ ነበር ሌላው ሱራ ያወረደው እነሱ ላይ መረጃ ለማድረግ ለ በጣም ማብራሪያ ለመስጠት ተፈልጎ ነው እንጂ እቺ ሱራ ብቻ በቂ ነበር ምክንያቱም ከሳር ይሁንና ከሳር ያለው ነው ለይ ተፈልጎ ተፈልጎ ይችላል ሰው ሁሉ ደግሞ መዳን ነው የሚፈልገው ፈላህ መውጣት ነው የሚፈልገው ስለዚህ እንጂ ሱራ ላይ ተብራቶ የተቀመጠ ስለሆነ እቺ በቂ ነበር ይችላል ኢማሙ ሻፊዒ رحمه الله تعالى لذيهم بخاري بتاوقوا كتاب ليس في البخاري كقران قتلوا شريعتين مسرت ادرغو من التكنبت يسن كتاب البخاري نا مسلم بذا البخاري لي باب يان داند مراق وين دمو يان داند كفل يسيم بترس تلك بوتا يسطوا لذا يان كتاب بمن مار بتوت مالنا بذا كفل لي عند مراق من بلو سيموال باب العلم قبل قبل القول والعمل اوقات كنغغرنا كتغبار بفيت يقدمال بلو مرجا من ادرك امتا قدم يتقص نوني الله سبحانه وتعالى نغغر فعلا انه لا اله الا الله واستغفر لذم ايهن مرجا ادرك امتا انا اوقات كنغغرنا كتغبار بفيت يقدمال بلوال انا ايهنن كنا انتغا ياو ለመካፈል ነው እንጂ እነዚህ ንግግሮች አደረኩት ያ መላእክቶች ከበውን እንጂ ቦታ ላይ መቀመጣችን ትልቅ አጅር እንደሚያስገኝ ነግሩን ንግግሩን ጨርሷል والله اعلم ጥያቄ ካላችሁ ጥያቄ ስለላላችሁ ያልገባችሁ ነገር ካለ
علم قبل القول والعمل اعلم انه لا اله الا الله استفتي لذنبك ايه قلت نعم استاذ جمال السلام عليكم زاد زياده على قوله تعالى ولا سين والعصر للذين امنوا الا الذين علموا ماذا قال الله سبحانه وتعالى الا الذين علموا بل قال الا الذين امنوا مؤمنون يرتسلون يرغب تما مالك قالوا نعم شيخ يستكملون علم بلولا استكملتنا عمل بلولا استكملتنا الدعوة إليه بلولا استكملتنا الصبر على الأذاب بلولا استكملتنا لا رأت ما الرجع كنان قد أمتها كنان قد وكالاتو تقال سنة تقام مداتشو إلا الذين آمنوا العلم بلولنا آمنوا بلولا قال علماء يات آمنوا بلولا لبت القرآن يقدر إيمانه بعد العلم لما هو للوتشن ما الرجاء وتشن بعد تاكا سمالكو زيادة ساعات وسلالة ساعات هذا الفنوس زيادة راسي جمبو لو كان خير راسي جمبو He gave us an extra Friday Is that Yeah, yeah, we have some time after Isha Mashallah You can just ask some more information <laughs> or we can take a break. It's okay. Yes, sir. It's up to you. Yeah. I don't. Inshallah. Mm. but you can tell them your history. Mm. Inshallah. If, uh, since the brother has asked me to speak a little bit more because of Salat al Isha. Uh, is approaching, but uh, maybe to extend our time a little bit. I'll tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, my name is Khalid Green. I'm known as Abu Abdurrahman uh, from America. And I um, have been Muslim for 15 years now. And I uh, spent most of them, about half my time in America and half my time also between Saudi Arabia and also Yemen. I studied a little bit in Yemen and also in Saudi Arabia to learn uh, the Arabic language. Now, Khalid Simu, Khalid Green, Balwin Dumu, Kunio, Abu Abdul Rahman, Balwin Dumu, 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 no. Uh, I became Muslim. It's a long story, not a very exciting story, but I became Muslim anyway, mainly through reading books. Mainly through reading books, reading the Quran as it was tra- uh, the translated ver- uh, translated uh, text of the Quran, also from uh, reading about the autobiography, the story of a very famous Muslim who died in uh, in America named Malcolm X. So he influenced me, and his story and his life change, and the way the things that he went through in his life, this influenced me and gave me an interest in Islam. of my uh, of my embracing Islam 
But what I would like to share with you is the importance of seeking the knowledge, as, as we've been talking about, that it's very important for you as Muslims here in Ethiopia to seek the knowledge. And especially many of you, all of you are pretty much young men in your shabab, uh, that you should seek the knowledge and learn and, of course, practice and share the knowledge. Because as we see, we see that the Christians and others are busy giving da'wah. They, they have a lot of nishat. They have money and they have activity. But we have the haq. We have Islam. We have kitab Allah wa sunnah to Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So we have the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So we must practice it and call the people to it. So learn the Quran as uh, as I've heard that you you have a madrasa here. Learn the Quran, you know, hif the Quran also, uh, and of course the Sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Also try to get something from the Arabic language. Try to learn Arabic because this is important that you can understand the Quran and the Sunnah. You need the Arabic language. The Arabic language is a miftah. It's a key in order to, in order to understand the Quran and the Sunnah from its asal, from the sources. Not just uh, translated and not just translated uh, durus, but you need to go to the asal, go to the kitab or Sunnah. And really, Alhamdulillah, because a lot of you are, are young and, and so forth, especially the young children, very important to impress on them to memorize the Qur'an. Because this is the nusus, this is the evidences, as we talked about. We said the ilm, we said the amal, we said the da'wah, and we said the sabr. And with that, with that, uh, the ilm, part of that ilm is memorizing the nusus. And this is something that I wish I had the benefit of. And inshallah ta'ala, I'm hoping myself to, uh, uh, to of course continue seeking the knowledge, but also to spend time memorizing because this is where you find in yourself, you find a weakness if you don't have, uh, something significant of the Quran memorized and of the Sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam.
እነዚህ ነገሮች ለማህበረሰብ ጥረት መቻል መቻል አለብን ይላል። جزاك ما الله خيرا again and inshallah ta'ala i hope that uh, we all were able to get some benefit from this inshallah ta'ala and uh, i hope to see and benefit from you again inshallah jazakumullah khairan